Now that you have your picture open, we can remove the green background. To do this, you're going to need to access the toolbox. If it's not showing on your screen, go up to the window menu, click on it and select tools. You've now got a number of different tools that you can use. Today we're going to be concentrating on the Magic Wand tool. That's fourth one down from the top on the left. Select it and then click in your green area. The computer will make an estimation of what areas of the picture are green. You'll see this halo mark showing which areas it's going to keep and which areas it's going to delete. You can go ahead and press delete on your keyboard to see what it's going to delete. If it's deleted too much, press undo, which is up here at the top, and then you're going to need to adjust the tolerance. Adjust the tolerance down just a few steps at a time. I'm going to go to 45 and re click in the green area. You'll see now that the halo is around less of my picture, but it's still cutting out a significant part of my head. I'm going to reduce it down a little bit further and try again. Again, it's become a bit more sensitive however it's still going to cut off my hair. Just by gently moving down the bar to 32% I've now included most of my body and my head in the picture. I can still see just around the edges there's a few bits that it's wanting to cut off so I'm just going to raise it down a little bit lower. A couple more notches should do it and you can see now that it's got a pretty good representation of where the green is. If I go ahead now and press delete on my keyboard, it has removed all of the green background. You might still see a green halo around your body and your head, but that's perfectly normal.